finally got my next box from Steel to Real. I believe this is box number three. So we're going to open it up and see what we got. Whoops. I'm not very straight cutter. Let's see what we got on our box number three. Okay. Put that back in my pocket. I think they're getting smaller, but anyways. Oh, the first thing we got is a Tack Vivi sleeping bag. I've been actually wanting one of these. This is great. So we're going to open. That's our Tack Vivi. What's it say size wise? It doesn't really say. But this is an emergency. Oh, yeah. Uh, 84 inches by 36 inches. But I've been actually looking at these on the uh, on my thing that I like to order. But it's got a carabiner there, but I've been looking for one of these. Got the whistle too. Oh, yeah, in the cord. We might actually take that out in a minute, but we've got the Tack Bivy sleeping bag. Cool. I'm excited about that. Alright, my next item is fire starting. It looks like it says it's a fire starting kit. Yeah, looks like some waterproof it's wind resistant got matches. 12 hurricane matches and three fire starters. So we'll look at that in a minute. Okay. Oh, okay. We've got the candle. Four, four hour, hour candle. Nano. nano. It's got three of them in here, it looks like. Three different sets of them. But. Uh, yeah, I'm excited about the candle. I've heard about these too. So this is actually pretty neat one. I'm excited more about this one. And then we got the Massive Wet Wipes. This is shower on the go. They're extra large. And actually, I have actually was looking at one of those towel things too. So I think that's what that is. So they must have been watching what I've been looking at and sending me stuff this time. Okay, but there's that. Of course, I like this shred. I like to put this in with my uh, fire starter and stuff because this stuff is a good fire starter. So I actually keep that. Even though they put that in the box, that's a bonus for me because I like to keep that shred. I got a container and that's good. Okay, so my next thing is a rifle ammo pouch by Mossy Oak. So it shows where, it, I guess it shows your ammo. It's an ammo pouch. One, two, three, four, five. Fourteen rounds. Okay, fourteen rounds. But anyways, yeah, fourteen round rifle cartridge loops. So if you don't use it for that, I'm sure you can use it for something else. But it, it's got a, a clip. But we'll look at that in a minute. So that's everything in this box. I don't think I see any other little hidden gems in here. Just to make sure it's nothing small. That was all that was in this box. I'm going to put this back in here. But I keep that. I love that shred. That's good stuff. And this can actually be shred too. But now let's go over the things. So in this box, this is, I believe, is our third box. This is the beginner level one. It's still to real. It's a box month club of box club of the month. And so this is only level one. Now, if you would go up to another level, you get different things. But I'm really kind of pleased with this box because I've got a couple different items in here that I was actually kind of looking at. So we'll go ahead and open up the mossy thing. It's got, I can take these off here. It does have, like what did you, what kind of count did you count? 16, 14? 14. 14 of these loops, I guess, that you can put your rounds in. Uh, it folds in a tri-fold like a wallet. You could put this belt around it. This has got like a, one of these like this, where you could put it around and snap it shut where your ammo is not going to come out. So that's one of the items. I don't see any other pockets other than these loops, but that's a pretty cool thing. Yeah, well, that'll fit the rifle shells for deer season. All right, so this might go to my husband because he says he's got some stuff. 
Okay. These fire starting, it's got 12 hurricane matches and three fire starters. So let's take this out of the box and look at it. Oh, okay. It comes in a nice little waterproof, con waterproof container. container. It's got some sandpaper or something to strike your matches with right here. So it's waterproof, so if this would get wet. Y'all take a drink every time she says so. Okay. <laughs> All right. This, oh wow, these are really long matches. These will probably light a oh, while. Wow. Let's see how long it does say they light. A uh, waterproof case with three replaceable strikes, strikers, 12 hurricane matches, windproof, rainproof, and burns up to 12 seconds. So that's pretty good. Uh, and then it has three sweet fire tablets. So here's the sweet tablets right here. Plus the strikers. Plus the strikers. They do give you some extra strikers in there. And um, unused fire starters in a plat to keep them to last longer. They want you to keep them in the plastic group. But apparently you can break these off a little piece at a time or cut a shaving off of it and it will start. So that we might test that out in the field to see how long one of these burn or a piece of this burns, how that burns. So, anyway, without saying the word so. <laughs> but those are the matches. And this is kind of a nice container too. That you could keep refill your matches and i do like where it has these little cubes that you could put right in there with it so you got your matches and your cube starter i better put these in first and then put the matches around it but i think that's kind of cool i like it i like it put those in there On each side and then when you put the lid on it's got a ring in there to keep it sealed too I see the ring like a rubber ring whoops I got a screwed on right so I the only thing is I don't see like a lanyard holder to kind of hold it but other than that that's pretty cool alrighty there's that now, this is those candle tins. These are four hours. And apparently we get three of them. So, I'm going You're to... You're going to have to use your pen knife to cut that wax off. I mean, plastic. I got it, sweet. Never mind. She's got fingernails. She just as soon break them. One wick with 100% bee wax. Candle tin. And it says it runs for four hours. So, that's what it looks like. And um, I'll have to watch the video on this again, but the way I seen it, they light it and then you, you can put it out and light it and put it out or whatever. But these are kind of really neat. I, I was looking at this, so this was kind of cool. But you get three of those. So that's four, 12, 12 hours of burn time if I would need them. So there's that. And this is a massive wet wipe, shower on the go. It is 1.6 feet by 2.6 feet. So basically, you wipe your, take it out of the bag and wipe yourself down from top to yeah, bottom. Yeah, because it's and you're moist. Good. You can feel it. I don't really want to open this up to I'm about to use it, but it does have a resealable thing. So we would tear that off and resealable. I'm, I'm kind of interested to see it, but I hate to open it up. She does need a bath. I do need a bath. Hey, I just had one. <laughs> Each pack it contains one shower on the go. So it's already, you can feel it, it's already got a little bit of liquid in it. Oh, let's open it. No, don't. Wait till we go to camp. When we go to camp, in one of our videos, we will be using this. You'll be able to see us do that. Because every time we get something, we definitely take it out in the field and we try them out. So this is interesting. It's got... You can take and wipe yourself off. That's pretty good. Uh, did it say it was reusable or one-time thing? Let me just read a minute to see if it's a... Because it reseals, so I'm wondering, is it something that you could reuse? Help kills germs, element, 
odors and removes dirt and It's sweat. like the Marmy wipes you got before. You don't yeah. throw it away anyhow, just so you can seal it up and not leak it all over your stuff, probably. I guess you could use it a couple times and then once it dries out. Just one of our non toxic. Hmm. Let me just kill some. Okay, I don't know. We'll, when we go to camp, we'll try that out. Now. You're going to need the whole floor for that. I'm not going to take the whole thing out. I'm just going to look at it a minute. Again, you'll see us with this. We're going to try this out at our campsite, too. Because I have really been looking at one of these bivy things. And I think this is a good thing to have, like, out in your one of your bags. Like, your prepared bags or your bug out bags. Because it does smack up, it does pack up pretty small. And you can see it's got its own little bag here. That's how small it is. It does have a carabiner on it, so you could hang it onto your back of your pack. It also has the draw string here, where you can pull it tight. Okay. I do like the little bag, but. The material itself, of course, it's going to be like a Milo material. It's got the orange on one side and the Milo silver on the other side. Is it as heavy as the SOL blanket? I mean, um, as far as the material feels? The material does feel pretty thick. That That's pretty thick material. It's not a real thin one. And it feels more rubbery than, you know, that other one. This one feels a little bit more rubbery. So I think this one will last a little bit better or not puncture as easy. But I'm not going to roll this up. You will see us use this at a campsite that we use it in. But I do like it because it's like an emergency. It's a, and it is reusable. Emergency yes. reusable sleeping bag. So it's something we can get out and then use it again. Well, those, some of those uh, Milo blankets are one and done. You use them once and they're done. That's Milo, right? Yeah. Yeah. But I like the feel of that. That's It, it, it feels like it's kind of even puncture proof. I'm no... Yeah, that's pretty tough. Okay. So, at one of our campsites, you'll see us maybe get this out and, and see how it keeps us warm and stuff. But, I like the little bag it comes in. That's really nice. Put that back in there. This would be Does perfect. it have a temperature reading on it somewhere? Let's see if it has a temperature reading. Wind and waterproof material keeps you out of the wind and rain but can keep con condensancy in condensation but can keep condensation in condensation it's lightweight in and easy or out. it says wind and waterproof material keeps you out of the wind and rain but can keep condensation in so you'll be, if you sweat you'll get it wet yeah yeah lightweight and easy <laughs> to carry it's a 4.7 ounces compact shelter with rip stop nylon storage bag full body protection measures 84 inches by 36 inches this bag can be can this bag can protect a person up to seven feet long seven feet tall so you can be pretty tall and it would still cover you the paracord drawstring used to repair or tie down gear uh, oh and it's got a whistle on the end of it that yeah it's got an emergency whistle Uh, Built-in fire tender cord can be used as a fire starter. A whistle is a 120 decibel emergency whistle. The carabiner is useful for attaching to your bivy to a pack or belt, and it is not for climbing. So, what was the question you wanted? I don't, temperature oh, rating. Oh, it doesn't it? show a temperature rating. Oh, wait a minute. Or an heat R rating. reflects up to 90% of body heat to prevent from heat loss heat losing heat to cold surfaces okay so reflects up to 90 percent of your body heat but it don't have an r value okay. i'm not seeing an r value other than this 2.0 i don't know if that would be a rating or that's that... just the name of the bivy all right that's the name of the bivy okay it has the heat echo technology so but anyway again 
when we get these things, we always, uh, we do try them out. We take them out and we see what they, what they do. But I really like this. Now I only have to order one because I was going to order two. So now I only have to order one for one for me and one for my husband. But these are, these would be nice to have in each one of your to-go bags. In each vehicle. In each thing that we have. So I'm really tickled with this month's thing. Um, again, these are the items. These are all keepable items. Last time I wasn't exactly excited, but this time this is pretty good. All right, thanks for watching and keep watching our videos and you'll see us use these this equipment.